Welcome back your watching storyboard Serum Institute of India has launched a nationwide vaccination and immunization campaign called Swast Immunized India in association with Network 18 they have also roped in Bollywood actor Kareena Kapoor Khan storyboards Ankita Saxena caught up with Kareena on the sidelines of this launch listen to the full conversation I'm at the launch of the Swast Immunized India campaign by Serum Institute and I have with me an actor who turned the male dominated industry on its head. Marriage did not stop her neither did motherhood. She is still a force to reckon with. I have with me Kareena Kapoor Khan. Kareena, welcome to CNBC TV 18. Uh Kareena tell us about uh, the Swast Immunized India campaign and your association with it. Um I think I'm absolutely honored to be a part of the voice for this campaign because of course apart from natasha and adil being dear friends of mine when they actually spoke to me about this i think it was something that instantly connected and resonated with me it was something that um, i'm going through personally myself with temur going through mm-hmm. his immunization journey and um, understanding that how important it is for the growth of a, you know your child i think that to actually be someone who can you know speak about this openly who can come on to a platform mm-hmm. um <clears throat> and talk about this you yeah. know i think that i am hoping that people would find that connect that belief because basically people i think have to just believe in the voice True. and this is something that i'm personally speaking yeah. so i'm hoping that there would be that connect yeah. uh people would come out mm-hmm. and understand the uh, value of immunization understand the knowledge behind it karina you are now a mother of a baby boy so how important is it for you that your child gets vaccinated on time and how will you ensure that you know you give a healthy life to your child in fact i think a mothers we are constantly worried about our child every mother is like that every parent is like that we were constantly worried kare you know we don't want him to you know fall sick we don't want him to get a fever we don't want him to and these immunizations protect you from actually ri- life threatening diseases True. so this knowledge and this awareness has to be created amongst all the young mothers and all the young parents mm-hmm. out there in fact i'm very particular about my vaccination okay. chart i'm someone who is i make three copies of it so that i know that i have this and i'm tick marking it writing the date personally okay. myself okay. because i understand after researching that how important it is yeah. you know to um for our child and also i feel for our future generations i mean you know our children have to grow up in a healthy uh, prosperous atmosphere yeah so how do you think will this campaign help in us educating young indian parents about the importance of vaccination and more over dispelling the myths that surrounds vaccination and immunization in our country i think the idea is that of course the celebrity being attached to it is wonderful but of course yeah. we have amazing support from the government we yeah. have on all levels it's not just you know national state local all levels i think we're getting amazing mm-hmm. tremendous support with vaccinators mm-hmm. manufacturers coming together to serve the public you know whether yeah. it's serum institute india whether it's different different vaccinators are coming together yeah. we are ready to set up camps yeah. the government is doing that i think uh, with that combined with you know um the voice of a celebrity yeah. combined with us talking about it i feel even if there's a discussion that mm-hmm. starts you know yeah. Uh, with amongst people mm-hmm. i think that's the start of a yeah. journey you know for our swast immunized campaign true uh, karina you have practically endorsed everything under the sun right from hair care products to beauty products to bags uh, you name it and you have done it how is the, how is your endorsing a cause or getting associated with the cause uh, different from your other endorsements in terms of your approach and your involvement I think you know um, every artist has a certain um, image certain personality mm-hmm. certain persona that is attached to them yeah. I think that has uh, one thing that I think I've always kept in mind that it should you know definitely have some connectivity towards me Yeah um we see internationally that celebrities have brought about monumental social changes True. you know uh, across the globe and closer to home we've seen Mr Bachchan who's spoken so closely yeah. about polio and now you know where practically in a polio free nation which is amazing. Yeah. So I think if actors have that capacity to do it and this was something because being a mother and a young mother myself I completely understand even the myths and misconceptions you know which we have to battle. There is that constant uh, yeah. there are two sides to every coin but yeah. you know if you hear it personally from a mother who's experienced it as well yeah. we're hoping that that would you know lead this campaign and this um entire 
brainchild yeah. of Swasti Minaj's India yeah. to be a huge huge success. Yeah. Karina, what happens when a celebrity uh, decides to endorse a cause, you know, in terms of the reach, the awareness, probably the influence that you have? I think, like I said, we've seen it, you know, uh, take taken by storm, you know, the whole yeah. polio campaign. The yeah. idea is that, of course, this is Swasti Minaj's uh, Minaj India is also a campaign which I think, uh, you know, the government has supported so closely, you yeah. know, with Mission Andhra Thanush, with, you know, so many of that already where we've done work so much towards it from 2014 yeah. you know the government has been tirelessly working towards it and now to finally have a celebrity who's ready to talk about it openly yeah. who's ready to you know go out there want people not like i said not just in cities whereas in you know the smallest of yeah. you know villages yeah. in india that is where actually we want it to reach you know so if my voice could help with that i think that would, like I said, be yeah. the biggest joy and achievement to me. Yeah, Karina, uh, post motherhood, has your approach towards your brand endorsement deals changed in the sense that are you more conscious of uh, you know choosing brands that are more socially relevant or are brands with purpose? No, I think there's, it's always been something that uh, mm -hmm. you know would something that yeah with, a, with, yeah, with associates yeah. with yeah. me, you know. Uh, as far as this being, of course, you know, uh, socially so relevant and so important, yeah. I think this just happened because it was very organic. You know, the reaction was very like, you know, if I'm doing it, I would want every... Something that you're going through probably yes, right now. Yes, exactly. And yeah. if Temur is going through it, I would want, you know, the entire nation's child to go through it and, you know, yeah. have, you know, a healthy yeah. life ahead. That is what we all want. That is what we all mothers want for our child. True. Thank you so much for joining us, Karina. Thank Lovely you. having you. Thank you. With that, it's a wrap on Storyboard this week. You can catch all of our content on Facebook, Twitter and YouTube. Thanks for watching and we'll be back same time next week. See you soon.